I have a health condition that causes chronic pain. A friend suggested something called reflexology and sent me a link. It sounds similar to New Age practices and is based on ancient Chinese belief of qi, which involves energy in the body. With that history being said, to what extent do we steer clear of things that seem or appear New Age? I want to have good biblical boundaries, but also am open to practices like massage, which seem to be in the neutral zone. Am I wrong to want to avoid this suggestion? Okay, no, I don't think you're wrong at all. My best friend uh, has a chronic illness and is also an ex-New Ager, and I'm drawing from some of her experience when I say this, but you are perfectly within your right to say no to this, especially if it's not in line with your conscience before God. So first I wanna say that there's, there's just no measurable studies on this sort of stuff. A lot of it is pseudoscience or placebo, just being straight up with you. I did a video on reincarnation that kind of goes into this a little bit more in depth about past life regression therapy, but the thing is is that people go in expecting results. So just like a Todd White healing crusade, it's sort of something you're open and ready for, right? Like whether you get it or not, which makes it hard to tell if it actually worked or not. So I would say that it's fair to say that people who don't want to rely on medicine might consider this an option, but it's demonstrable that it doesn't always work and people can get worse. But let me submit another perspective because I am after all an ex new ager and my past self would disagree with myself now. Let's turn this on its head and say I'm totally wrong. Let's just say that it did help and it actually worked. This is where I would say there's an actual appeal to occult practices. Like this is exactly why people get into this stuff. People are going to be attracted to occult stuff specifically because it works. Occult temptations always start by working. Remember, occult doesn't mean that it doesn't work. It just simply means hidden or secret. There are short-term benefits to dabbling in occult stuff, which is why we like it so much, unfortunately. It gives us this like forbidden power. And there's nothing wrong with massage or things like that uh, that are physical and not spiritual, right? Um, to the extent that you avoid them has everything to do with what God has forbidden in this area. Not because he wants you to be miserable, but because there's an occult link to it that will leave a spiritual stain. Also, just another perspective on this, your denial could also be an opportunity to make them curious as to why you would refuse the offer. I think if done with love and tact, this could be a great opportunity to share the gospel with them.